Your main emphasis is going to be whether or not the temperature was held at 41 degrees or lower. And again, a lot depends on the products that are in there. If you have like vegetables, again, assess the quality. If you put fruits in there, assess the quality because you'll see whether or not it's spoilage. A lot of those temperature isn't as important. You have some of your staples. Butter would probably be fine depending on the temperature um, if you had condiments in there. But if you had meat, milk, um, anything like that where the temperature has to be at 41 degrees or lower, if it is like room temperature, discard it. If it's cold to the touch, cold, refrigerator cold, then the product would probably still be safe to consume. And that's refrigerator temperatures. As far as your freezer, if the food is frozen solid, you're going to be fine. If the food has started to thaw, if you access any ice crystals, you can refree refreeze that product. If it's like cold to the touch, but completely thawed, your best bet is to try to cook that product if it's doable and then refreeze it. Or if you're not sure, when in doubt, throw it out. Once power is back on and you've discovered that product has been lost, first discard that product and you want to also discard it where it cannot be used by anybody. Um, next, you want to unplug your refrigerator, make sure there is no power. And then you want to, you know, as you break it down, there could be trays or things that could be taken out, clean those with hot soapy water. Um, you might be, if they can run through a dishwasher, that would be fine. Then as far as the rest of the interior, you want to wash it down with hot soapy water. And then as far as sanitizing, you can use like a cup of bleach in a gallon of water, or you can use a cup of vinegar if you want to be green, as they say, in a gallon of water. Um, you can wash it down with those. If you have odors that persist, you can also like take those same solutions and just sit them in there and let it air for a couple of days. But then if you've done something like that, again, once you get ready to put product back in, you want to clean it one more time, make sure odors are gone. As far as once you're gearing the refrigerator freezer back up, remember it takes about 24 hours for the, the temperature to stabilize before you would want to put product back in. If there have been power outages, if there's been flood waters that may have gotten into your home and you're concerned about the utensils, dishes that are left, um, one, again, assess the quality of the products. And you have to cons assume that all flood waters are contaminated with sewage, chemicals, etc. Anything that's broken, anything like that, discard. Anything that's still usable, you would still want to wash them with hot soapy water. To sanitize those items, you still want to use a teaspoon of bleach to a gallon of water and those items need to sit in that solution for about 30 seconds or so.